Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Today I'm going to be doing the latest travel news worldwide. So let's jump right into it. Now according to breakingtravelnews.com, the following five points are basically the latest travel news worldwide so let's jump right into it now well done to Millennium Hotels and uh, Resorts and um, they unveil a new hygiene protocols so the Millennium Hotel and Resorts in the Middle East and Africa um, have uh, partnered with eCollab to deliver the, the highest level of hygiene and cleanliness to its guests across all properties in the region. So that is absolutely excellent news for Millennium Hotels and Resorts and also excellent news uh, for the countries in the Middle East and Africa as well um, so they can get their uh, tourism up and running and as safely as possible so that lo it looks at absolutely fantastic and I do wish the hotel group Millennium Hotels and Resorts like all accommodation and resorts well for the future and uh, number two is JA Resorts and Hotel win a WTTC stamp of approval um, to go above and beyond uh, above and beyond sorry in assuring guest safety um, JA Resorts and hotels have introduced a comprehensive program of hygiene protection and it wins the world or world, or world travel and tourism council a safe travel program um, so well done to JA Resorts and Hotels that's absolutely fantastic and again um, it's uh, also if people want to again travel to other countries the JA Resorts and Hotels have won an amazing stamp of appro uh, approval so again they've been doing a lot of work uh, to get, uh, get hygiene um, up to standard um, again and cleanliness just like uh, Millennium Hotels and Resorts um, but obviously the JH Resorts and Hotel actually win a world travel and tourism council a safe travels program award so again um i really hope um it's it uh, does their businesses so w well uh, both millennium hotels and resorts and ja resorts and hotels so wish them both the best of luck in the future JA Resorts have nine properties in the United Arab, Arab Emirates and the Indian Ocean so well done for getting all those properties up to standard also the, world, uh, the WTTC praises European efforts to reopen the tourism sector the world's 
the World Travel and Tourism Council have praised European efforts to reopen borders. So that's excellent news and um, thank you again. I, I bet the European uh, countries are also thanking the World Travel and Tourism Council of um, the praise um, to reopen European travel uh, to uh, people that want to travel to Europe and um, again so and number four is the Windhammer Hotel brings two new brands to Japan wow that's excellent the wide ham hotel and resorts has confirmed the continued expansion of its portfolio in Japan conversion to two hotels to the Wineham Grand and the Wineham Garden brands the 60 room all suite wide and grand Ashawima and the 95 room all suite Wideham Garden Nafari or Nachari excuse my pronunciation will both join the company so that's absolutely excellent news um, I, again I really hope it uh, goes well and um, for the country in the future and ob uh, obviously when it's uh, safe to travel to co uh, countries like japan etc um, people will uh, visit the hotel company and the hotels that the company already has so again well done to that hotel company now at last but not least um is number five tui resorts european summer programs the easing of travel restrictions in europe has enabled TUI to partially restart its summer holiday programme from July next month. Wow, that's excellent news. Uh, they plan to offer destinations in Spain and Greece and Cyprus, Italy, Croatia, Bulgaria, Portugal, Austria, Germany and Switzerland while Tiri Cruise is planning to restart operation offering just short three to four day cruises this summer so wow so I really hope it all goes to plan and travel companies uh, will get relaunched and I hope um, again it, it looks like also things are starting to look even more on the arc um, with hotel brands at, and up in their cleanliness or, or expanding um, also uh, travel companies um, being able to offer um, different or, or basically up their travel destinations that they go to in July and August time so again well done to that um, for a company as large as TUI for being able to do that and the crew set, set to trying to um, emerge as well just 
offering small three to four day cruises and um, again that is also a good idea for people to go on that have never experienced a, a cruise before um, and just want to know what it's like and just want a three to four day cruise that's all so um, I really hope um, everything uh, goes to plan uh, and I wish everybody well for the future and I hope co companies will be able to again la launch in the leisure and tourism sector and other companies around the world so i would like to say thank you for watching please like and subscribe if you haven't already done so also click the on the bell as well and you'll get to know all the videos that um, i upload every week for both my travel and lifestyle channel and please keep watching you can also watch lots of other videos that i've already made i've got on my travel and lifestyle channel and um, you can just go through the playlists um, on both of those so i wish everybody well for the future and uh, goodbye to now and thank you for watching i think you're all amazing and bye for now thank you bye